Hi, Charles Moment here. Well, this is sort of going to be a midweek update kind of episode. Pretty short. A funny thing happened while I was running the wiring. Let me tell you all about it. And thanks for watching. Yesterday, I was running the wire. So I, I got the wire running through for the uh, regular 110 outlets. And I took all the blue tape down and put new uh, identifying tape in spots to show where everything was going to be because things had changed some. And then I, I told my wife, I said, you know what, let's go buy a cabinet at Home Depot, whether we keep it or not, but we'll probably keep it. And I, I really would like to, to see it here so I can decide about the countertop. Because remember, we were going to have um, a cab, a cabinets running across here and this huge long 7 plus foot countertop with a bunch of cabinets. And I wasn't overly concerned, but you know, that's definitely going to add weight. But then yesterday, I picked up this cabinet, which is, um, let's see, it's 30 inches across and 24 deep. It's got a drawer and uh, two doors. And so we had it here. And while it was there, we started to think about, do we really need that much counter space? All of a sudden, I kind of fell into a trap. I was watching people that are full-timers, and I saw this beautiful long countertop. Oh, that's awesome. But then we, we thought, what are we really going to do? When we go camping, we're outdoors a lot. So we, and we don't camp to cook. We cook very simple things. And so um, that's not a big deal to us. So we kind of thought, why do we need all this countertop? And so what happened was, uh, we put this cabinet here. And my wife said, well, let's put the porta potty in the shower here. And then her, her bed's there, and my bed's here. And, uh, and then we could have a part that flips over in the middle. And um, so we kind of like that. But then this morning as I came out to, I've already got some 12-volt wiring ready to, to run through, already cut. And I thought, well, I'm going to try something. So I moved this over. And it fits perfectly right in here. The refrigerator it fits perfectly right in there. And we just now decided what we're going to do is keep this kitchen cabinet. We're going to not put the sink here. We're going to put a countertop here. Kitchen cabinets up here with the microwave. Coffee pot can be underneath here. And then we needed something smaller here. So I found uh, we're going to buy actually a bathroom vanity. And it's only 21 inches deep. So instead of this all getting squeezy, now we're going to have that. It's going to have the sink in it. And um, we can also uh, have a door there where I can pull out the gray water and dump it very easily. And um, so now it's going to be more space walking in here. And now it's going to be two six foot two sofas with a section that opens up. So we're actually going to have an area bigger than what a lot of full timers have uh, when we want to have that much space there. So I'm um, kind of excited about that. And so um, I need to go pick up that other cabinet. It's not really needing to be installed yet. But now I'm going to take all these pieces of tape again down and decide where I need the LED tape lights, the USB. Um, ports for reading lights and um, some of it will change some of it's going to stay the same so uh, that we all of a sudden kind of went back to what we had planned before with the sofa sofa but now we decided to make them both the same because we're either eating um, or we're sleeping or before bed we might watch a movie so I think I'm gonna have now the TV here or there on an arm and uh, hook up a computer to it and uh, we can watch a movie before we go to sleep and uh, I think this will work a lot better for us so I think this is the final design I think it is I spent a lot of time on the other plan though but I think it'll be okay so uh, there you go and um, by the end of the week I'll have another episode that will be actually showing um, all the 12 volt wiring and uh, I think we're going to do beadboard on the sides from Home Depot and then we're definitely doing the shiplap up here so um, all my 12 volt Puck lights have come in, some of my USB 12 volt ports have come in, and so and a few more plus nuts. I need to put I went crazy on the walls and I needed I need some for up here to put the support. So I'm hoping to show you a lot uh, this weekend. We'll see how it goes. And thanks for watching.